Chandrayaan 3. In English, translated from Hindi, it means Lunar Ship 3. The mission LVM 3, M4. The Moon. This celestial object in the night sky has inspired the imagination of astronomers and ordinary people for years. Since time immemorial, people have marveled at the beauty of the moon, using it to measure time and conquer new uncharted seas. In modern times, the moon, Earth's only natural satellite, has gained additional significance due to the belief that it is the key to our understanding of the evolution of the solar system as a whole and Earth in particular. Furthermore, the invaluable resources of the moon and its low gravity have brought the moon even closer to the human heart. As one of the largest spacefaring nations, India, as part of its Chandrayaan program, conducted a detailed exploration of the moon. India sent two robotic spacecraft for the exploration and further study of the moon's surface. Chandrayaan-1 demonstrated India's ability to reach the moon's surface at the right time and in the right place. In November 2008, India became the fourth country to reach the moon's surface. Furthermore, in 2009, Chandrayaan-1 proved the existence of water on the moon. This was a groundbreaking discovery that garnered admiration. The next mission was the Chandrayaan-2 mission, which included an orbiter, a lander named Vikram, and a lunar rover named Pragyan. Over the past four years, the Chandrayaan-2 orbiter has repeatedly observed the lunar surface, and even today, it continues to operate satisfactorily. Now, the Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft, weighing 3,900 kilograms, is being sent to the moon to achieve a soft landing on its surface and explore it using a rover. After the launch of the spacecraft by India's most powerful rocket, LVM-3, the Chandrayaan-3 lander module, containing the lunar rover inside, will be placed into orbit around the moon with the help of the propulsion module. A bit later, the lander module will detach from the propulsion module and perform a soft landing in the southern polar region of the Moon. This region is of great interest because it contains numerous permanently shadowed craters that may contain water ice and valuable minerals. The Chandrayaan-3 lander module is equipped with four scientific instruments one of which studies lunar seismic activity, while another allows for the investigation of heat flow through the moon's surface. The third instrument will study the plasma environment near the moon's surface, while the fourth instrument will enable scientists to measure the distance between Earth and the moon with high precision. Two instruments on the lunar rover help in studying the composition of the lunar surface using X-ray radiation and a laser, respectively. While the lander module and lunar rover will be in direct contact with each other, the propulsion module, orbiting around the moon, will observe the light coming from Earth, the only planet where life exists and about which we have definitive information. This observation will help us understand the nature of distant planets orbiting stars other than the Sun. During the launch of Chandrayaan, thousands of scientists from the Indian Space Research Organization, including those involved in the launch, mission control, and receiving scientific data using giant antennas, work on solving the complex challenges they face. The dedication and expertise of Indian scientists and researchers have earned praise from around the world and increased respect for India. Let's wish India success in this great endeavor called Chandrayaan-3.